it's okay. It's not definitely not the best. I think it's the best that you can mine out, but um, all the other armor, I think I can make like a demonite armor maybe or something. Maybe something higher than that. But uh, I don't think you can mine demonite ore. I didn't mean to set my spawn point again. That was kind of pointless. And uh, selling all of these things, and I think that I'm ready to go. I believe. Uh, yeah, so I decided that I would leave and go to the right and see that if I could find the end of the world. Because if I could explore all the way to the right, that means that um, I can go back to my current spawn point, or my old spawn point, where my city is, and um, then I would just need to go to the left and explore to the left. And then we'd have all of the board explored, right? Oh, and then I figure out that I have to have an axe to chop that down. There you come on, come on, Zim. Jeez. There you go. Alright, traveling over the crazy purple castle thing, um, and randomly moving around objects that I really don't have a point for. I think I ended up moving those objects around just so I could have things to put down and jump on. Uh, some kind of blocks. Because having blocks to use are always nice. And I figured I would cut the grass as I go. Because I am a good Samaritan. Yeah, see, I don't think I'm going to be able to get up there without a block. There we go. Alright. And I don't believe that, um... Is it turning daytime or nighttime? I think it's turning nighttime. It looks like it's turning nighttime. Or maybe... No? The zombies were attacking me, so maybe it's turning daytime. And there's a cave in which is some cobwebs and... Nothing... Not really of importance. Some uh, thing I'm gonna do, which is always a good thing. Some uh, jars, and that's as far as I decide to go, because I don't think that I would be able to fit any farther down there. And uh, I decide to go down this way, and down this way is more water. I hate water. Water stinks, and uh, I decide that. Going the rest of the way down is probably not a good idea. Water, I do not want to be in water at the moment. Not until I can find something to uh, at least help me out a little bit. And then I decide that it's time to leave. It is time to go. Um, now, usually usually there's caves like this that go semi-far down. Usually they don't end like that. Usually if you can find a cave that's at least semi-deep, it'll go down for a good ways. Uh, like that chasm over by our uh, little town. That chasm went down a really, really far away. And more corruption. Yay. How I love corruption. Luckily, we have this cool sword now. So the, um, the little, whatever those things are, the one-eyed little things that look like they're off spore, those things die really easily. Jump. They do look like they're off spore, don't they? Eater... What, what, what was it? Soul Eater or something like that? I don't know. Um, but uh, I cannot mine this rock yet. These chasms, I cannot mine those yet. Yeah, I think it was an Eater of Soul. Or something to that effect. I don't I don't even know. But uh, we can't mine those... Uh, this uh, Ebon Stone, I think is what it's called. Or I, I don't know what it's called. I really don't. Um, I can't remember. Oh, don't want to... Oh, well. Apparently I decided that it was time to fall in a pit that was completely pointless. Don't know why I did that, but um, I'm sure that past me had a good reason for it. And put purple blocks all through it to make it look pretty. Um, and, uh, yeah, as I was saying, you can't mine these, uh, this rock that's in these chasms until you get a demonite pick. And the only way that I know of that you can find demonite is bosses. You may be able to find it really, really deep in the, in the, um, I want to get to that, but I can't. You may need, you may be able to find it really, really deep in the, um, in the ground, but I don't, I don't know. I, I couldn't, uh, I couldn't find it, and I went pretty far down. We were way down there, and I went a little bit farther after, after, uh, it stopped. Or after you guys left me. Oh, I got a breathing tube, and, um... I am running out of air. I should probably hurry up. Come on, live! 
get get the breathing rod out. Oh no. Actually, they uh they've they've really really lowered the rate at which you drown. Um, back in like beta when they were testing it out, whenever you would drown, you would um die almost instantly right after you ran out of breath. Uh, I decided that I would try and see what was what was going down over here because this is a really deep ocean, and uh, I thought I would try and at least find out what was going on. And at this point, I realized it's the end of the world. <laughs> so back across to the other side of wherever I was going. Uh, back to my base, and then from my base to the um to the other thing. And uh, at this point, I am thinking, I think what I said is I want to get to that. But I also said that um, I want to find a demon altar. So I decided that I was going to walk back, I think, and look for demon altars. I think is what I said, maybe? I don't know, I'm just jumping up and down with the little bamboo shoot. Oh, okay, so I decided to skip to when I found a demon altar, and there is a demon altar right there. Um... Unfortunately, I don't know that um, that I need a uh, a demon. I had I need a demon pick to get to it. Unfortunately, I don't know that um, whatever. What, what, what's what's it called? Uh, dynamite. Yes, that's that's the word I was looking for. I don't know that dynamite actually blows up this stone right here. If I had known that, I would have used my dynamite to get through and definitely get to that demon altar. But, um, I didn't know that, so, uh, this is what I, I, I think, do I actually try? Oh, I do, wow. Wow, hey, I may, uh, oh, I don't remember doing that. Okay, go me. Yay. Man, I'm awesome. Um, oh, yeah, <laughs> I just fail. I, I understood that. That, that would blow that up. There's another demon altar up there. Um, and I failed again, and now unfortunately I only have one dynamite left. Because I'm a moron. And I decided uh, that I would try and uh, make... I think I tried to make like a little cup to where the dynamite would fall into the cup. Oh, there's a worm. Come on, Zim. You can get the sword out faster than that. Um... I think, didn't I try to get to the demonite ore? No, did I, I, ju I just decided to leave, apparently. Or the demonite, demon altar thing. That's a bummer. Oh no, I decided that I wanted to get to this thing more than the demon altar, because I'm weird. Because um, I only had one piece of dynamite left. And I thought, oh, well, I can just stick it right there, and it should blow me a hole big enough to get in. Uh, but unfortunately, apparently, um, I did get in, luckily, go me, <laughs> but apparently I can't break that little thing until I get a pick or something. I'm not even really sure how to break that as of yet. I'm sure I will figure that out in the next couple videos. Um, and so I kind of start being sad and I'm trying to use everything that I have to see if any of it will break it, but it doesn't. And I really should have used that last piece of dynamite to get to the demonite, um, the demonite, uh, demon, or the, the demon altar, or whatever that thing is called. I think it's called a demon altar. Come on, Zim. Uh, well, you're gonna have to use a, a block. Alright. Uh, but actually, whenever I start playing again, I think that that's probably what I'll go do. I'll probably go, um, see if I can find, uh, a way to get into that demon altar. I think I still had some dynamite left over. So we may come back to this very point and get into that demon altar. That seems like a good idea. And, um, digging downward. Digging downwards always. Oh, oh, I remember. I thought that, um, I would try and, uh, dig down to it through the two chasms, but uh, it was blocked off. So that idea failed miserably. And, uh,. I guess I'm going to walk all the way back. Is that what I'm going to do? Really? I'm going... I think I'm going to still look for demon altar things. But, um... Maybe I'm not. I, don't, I really don't know what I'm doing. I, 
think, uh, oh, one second, hold on. Alright, sorry about that. Um, back to playing. Uh, hopefully my voice isn't going to be off-kiltered about what I'm talking about. Um, because I got a phone call, had to talk some to somebody. Hopefully I can just edit this to where it'll work. I hope. That would, that would kind of be a bummer if I had to, uh, redo all of this. I think we'll be okay, though. Hopefully we will do perfectly fine. I probably will try to edit it out and uh, get that to work correctly. So, um, at this point, I'm going to go up this crazy thing and across. Uh, there we go. Perfect. And uh, I think I decide that I'm going to um, to uh, try and get rid of my home, I think. Or sell some stuff. Yeah. Sell some stuff. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to kill this bed and sell things. Um, I'm praying that I edit this out, because this took a while, if I remember correctly. No, I'm going to destroy this house, because I am... Uh, I, the reason why I want to destroy this house is that I want the, um, the arms dealer to leave this place and go back to where I was before. So... Hopefully that'll work. We will find that out sooner or later. And uh, I decided to absolutely destroy everything and put some holes in the wall just to make sure that he wasn't going to live here any longer. All right, and then I heroically save him from a bunch of slimes and uh, some rotten chunks. And I decided that I would try to take everything that I could with me um, and throw everything out that was completely useless. Take some silk... Uh, probably sell that, take more dynamite, which I wish I had. I really should have gone back to that demon altar, demonite altar, but um, one of the things that I needed to do was um, go back to my home base, because I had uh, a lot more lenses and a lot more rotten chunks there. So I needed to get those out before I wanted to fight the boss. Alright, I think that's pretty much everything. That's probably a good thing. There we go. I am... Oh, fail. Look at that. Failure invaders in. Wow, that was just embarrassing. So now I have a more stuff that I really don't want. That I didn't mean to pick up. Alright, I think that's everything. And apparently I want to toss out some mushrooms. And I'm not really sure why. But I did. So, I guess that's what I did. And I skipped to this point. I had, uh, I walked all, all the way back and uh, threw a blood moon because I am um, stubborn like that. And I killed lots and lots of zombies. Lots and lots and lots and lots of zombies. Uh, and I think I decided... I got some shackles, which I think... Yeah, they come from... Obviously, that one just dropped one. They come from zombies, um, and... They are extremely useful for low-level people, because if you don't have uh, all of your accessory slots filled up, you can just put on a bunch of shackles and get a lot of defense out of it. It's a very good thing. And there's an eyeball. And, uh... That eyeball is beating up my poor dynamite guy. Would you guys leave my dynamite guy alone? I think I decided to go save him. Hmm. Alrighty. And... Um... Yeah, I can't hit things through open doors. So, I decided that I would organize my inventory at this point. So, I went through and I organized everything. Um, I put everything in a rightful place. Uh, I believe all of my money goes in here. And uh, my ore and my demonite bars. And I think I have some kind of... Yeah, corruption seeds. I'm not really sure what those do. I think that they just start corruption, which is kind of cool. And I decided to put my, you know, handgun and my bullets inside of my piggy bank. Isn't that what you guys do? And an aqua scepter. I figured that I would keep the magic missile. Uh, I think this is maybe the point where I actually figure out how to use the thing. Yeah. See, you get to drag it around. And it's awesome. Look at that. That's just so cool. And uh, whenever it hits stuff, it's... Uh, it does quite a bit of damage, so that's cool. And uh, I think I end up buying the dirt rod because I enjoy wasting my money on useless 